For the past month, we told you about the Supermom Contest here at News Channel 7, and last week we announced our special winner. And News Channel 7's Nicole Morton had the pleasure to hang out with the Supermom, and now Nicole joins us in the studio to tell us about this incredible mom and her incredible journey. That's right. Frances Spann of Panama City is the winner of our Supermom Mother's Day Contest. That's after Spann's nine-year-old son, Bray, wrote us a letter to brag about how special his mom is. Well, I got the chance to hang out with the family this weekend. And down in Paris, Frances has an extraordinary story. Take a listen. <laughs> I love being a mom. It, it's my calling. It's, it's what I do. I love getting up in the mornings and taking Bray to school and coming home and being with Brock. She takes her motherhood, motherhood very seriously. She is a super mom. She is a great mom. For the past six months, this 30-year-old super mom has been battling the hardest journey of her life. I finally decided to go to the neurologist for headaches that I had been having October of 2009. Um, at the very end of the conversation, I just thought that they were migraines that had gotten really, really bad. At the end of the appointment, she said, um, you know, let's just get an MRI just to check, just to make sure. Not even 24 hours later, Span received a phone call that quickly changed her life. The very next morning, she called me and said that I had a um, pretty significantly large tumor on the left side of my brain. So it was very shocking. At such a young age, happily married with two young boys, life was just getting started. My husband and I hibernated for two or three days and we cried and we you know were devastated devastated by the news it, it hit me pretty hard too because then you think of your children of course you know am I going to be alone in this the doctor convinced Span the benefits of surgery outweighed the risks now six months later Span is living proof miracles do happen I'm definitely a fighter I, I honestly have to say that I didn't realize what a fighter I was until this came along. And with an army of supporters rooting her on, she continues to navigate her way through the battlefield. This is a type of tumor that grows back um, all over the brain and all over the um, spinal cord, so I have to go back every three months for checkups. And I have a few spots now that we're watching to see if um, there are tumor cells growing back, but it's just a process. <laughs> Today, the Miracle Mom enjoyed her special day with her family. As for what the future may hold, Span says she and her family are taking it one step at a time. It's made us realize that, that nothing's given, that, that tomorrow is not a given, um, that all this could be taken with the next tumor. Now, if you'd like to get to know Span and learn more about her journey, you can read her blog. You can find that on our web channel by clicking on this story. Back to you. Wow, okay. what a great story. Wow. And as the winner of our Supermom contest, Frances is rewarded with some much needed pampering and R&R &R this week. And okay. uh, go to our web channel, read more about her amazing story. And, That's right. And the story that her son Bray wrote about her, that so won neat. her the Supermom so contest. Good for you, Bray, and, and you guys That's keep awesome. it up. Keep up the good work. To be honored by your kid. That is yes. just such a That's blessing, great. too. All right, we have much more ahead in just a moment. That's right. Stick around. Good stuff to come.